Hi friends, I am Dr. Chowdhury. I welcome you all to this video, Inverse Laplace Transformation. In this video, I am going to explain how to solve the following ordinary differential equations. Before we are going to see the problems, we need to remember some important formulas and results. These are L of y triple dash of t equal to s cube into L of y of t minus s square into y of 0 minus s into y dash of 0 minus y double dash of 0. Then Laplace transformation of second derivative that is L of y double dash of t equal to s square into L of y of t minus s into y of 0 minus y dash of 0. And third one, L of y dash of t equal to s into L of y of t minus y of 0. And the results, Laplace transformation of e power minus at equal to 1 by s plus e. And corresponding inverse, L inverse of 1 by s plus a equal to e power minus at. By the way, Laplace transformation of e power at equal to 1 by s minus a. The corresponding inverse, 1 by s minus a equal to e power at. L of t power n value equal to n factorial divided by s power n plus 1. The corresponding L inverse, L inverse of 1 by s power n plus 1 equal to t power n divided by n factorial. Also, Laplace transformation of any constant equal to k by s. The same way, L inverse of any constant by s equal to the same constant. Now let us discuss the problem. Solve the differential equation y triple dash minus 3y double dash plus 3y dash minus y equal to t squared into e power t with the initial condition y of 0 equal to 1, y dash of 0 equal to 0, y double dash of 0 equal to minus 2. First of all, we write this given differential equation in the original form y triple dash of t minus 3y double dash of t plus 3y dash of t minus y of t equal to t squared into e power t. As for the procedure, first of all, we are taking Laplace transformation on both sides. Using linearity property, we can write L of y triple dash of t minus 3 into L of y double dash of t plus 3 into L of y dash of t minus L of y of t equal to L of t squared into e power t. Now look at this equation. See the right hand side, Laplace transformation of e power t into t square. Here, t square considers the elementary function f of t. e power t considers the shifting operator. Then apply the formula L of y triple dash. Then apply the formula L of y double dash. Then we apply the formula L of y dash. Then minus L of y of t as it is. Now we come to the right hand side. As for the shifting property, first we have to find the Laplace transformation of t square. Then we replace s by s minus 1. Now L of t square value equal to 2 by s cube. Here replacing s by s minus 1, we can get 2 by s minus 1 whole cube. Using the initial condition y of 0 equal to 1, y dash of 0 equal to 0, y double dash of 0 equal to minus 2. Therefore, y of 0 goes to 1, y dash of 0 goes to 0, y double dash of 0 goes to minus 2. Let's see the second term, y of 0 goes to 1, y dash of 0 goes to 0. See the third term, y of 0 goes to 1, remaining term as it is. Now we simplify this equation. S cube into L of y of t minus S square plus 2. Next, minus 3 into S square into L of y of t plus 3s. Next, plus 3s into L of y of t minus 3. Then minus L of y of t as it is. Equal to 2 by S minus 1 whole cube. Now we are taking L of y of t common. Therefore, S cube minus 3S square plus 3S minus 1 into L of Y of T and non-common term minus S square plus 3S minus 1 equal to 2 by S minus 1 whole cube. Here, S cube minus 3S square plus 3S minus 1 in the short form S minus 1 whole cube. Therefore, S minus 1 whole cube into L of Y of T. Then, minus S square plus 3S minus 1 bring to right hand side. Therefore, 2 by S minus 1 whole cube plus s square minus 3s plus 1. See this equation, s minus 1 comes often. Therefore, s square minus 3s plus 1 in order to s minus 1, I can write minus 3s as minus 2s minus s. Now look at this equation, s square minus 2s plus 1 can be written as s minus 1 whole square. 
now s minus one whole cube bring to right hand side therefore l of y of t equal to 2 by s minus one whole cube into s minus one whole cube plus s minus one whole square divided by s minus one whole cube minus s by s minus one whole cube simplifying this we can get 2 by s minus one whole power 6 plus s minus one whole square will be cancelled therefore 1 by s minus 1. Look at this equation, numerator s only, denominator s minus 1. So in order to the denominator s minus 1, we add and subtract 1 in numerator. Therefore, minus s minus 1 plus 1 divided by s minus 1 whole cube. Now, expand this term as 2 by s minus 1 whole power 6 plus 1 by s minus 1 minus s minus 1 divided by s minus 1 whole cube minus 1 by s minus 1 whole cube. Now see this equation, without using the partial fraction or any other decide method, we split it into correct one by simplification itself. This is the final one. Now taking inverse Laplace transformation on both sides, O e of t equal to L inverse of 2 by s minus 1 whole power 6 plus L inverse of 1 by s minus 1 minus L inverse of 1 by s minus 1 whole square minus L inverse of 1 by s minus 1 whole cube by linearity property. Since L inverse of f of s shifted to s minus a that is f of s minus a equal to e power a t into L inverse of f of s and L inverse of 1 by s minus a equal to e power a t. Using this formula see the first term goes to 2 into s shifted to 1 so e power a t a plus 1 so e power t into l inverse of 1 by s power 6 see the second term e power t and third term s shifted to s minus 1 therefore the shifting one taken outside e power t into l inverse of 1 by s square minus the shifted term come outside e power t into l inverse of 1 by s cube now we apply the formula L inverse of 1 by s power 6. It may be considered L inverse of 1 by s power 5 plus 1. Therefore, t power 5 divided by 5 factorial. And the L inverse of 1 by s square formula. That is L inverse of 1 by s power 1 plus 1. Answer t. And L inverse of 1 by s cube. It may be considered L inverse of 1 by s power 2 plus 1. Therefore, t squared by t factorial. Therefore, y of t equal to t power 5 into e power t divided by 60 plus e power t minus e power t into t minus t square into e power t divided by 2. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any doubt or if you want to have any explanation for any problem, post in comment. I will explain in some other video.